I'm Michelle Johnson. I'm one who believes in soaking all that you can in in life and taking every opportunity to explore. I've been blessed with a great opportunity to travel and meet my father, Gary Van Haas, in Goa, India. And we're going to see what life has to offer and what surprises and gifts this adventure may bring. Baby, please come on home to me. We woke up this morning, power is out. So this is a common thing around here. Dad's up, and uh, with some candles. Yeah, the sun's coming up slowly, slowly. It's about 6.30 in the morning, right? Yeah. We can't even make any coffee or anything, so just hang out. Taking a little ride out in the morning with Dad. Yeah. Uh, power's out, so decided to get out of the house. There's no point sitting in there. Yeah. You can't even make coffee or anything, right? Right. It'll be on by the time we get back, I'm sure. It's a common occurrence here, apparently. Yeah, on and off. All right. There's a cow. Is this a cow? Yeah. Run of a bull. Better. <laughs> Stand up tall, toes forward. Try not to lean forward. Pull your shoulders back. Pull your belly in a little. Does it feel awkward? Does it feel awkward, Dad? Yeah. But it's good. It's good for your posture. Dogs. There's multiple dogs, and they have their own territory. They're just all over the beach. Somebody will cross over someone's territory. And they all gang up. It's like a gang. Right? And then the dogs get lost. Hey, puppy. Yes, this one thinks I'm his new owner. Keeps hanging around me. Oh, sweetie. Oh. Oh. He just jumped up on dad. What are you doing, pup? jumped up on my dad. Aww. Bye, Boo. Bye. And there are kitties. Just randomly running around, too. Little hungry animals. It's shocking to see the amount of trash all over the city hidden behind things so that the animals can tear it apart and use it as a source of nourishment. The animals are hungry as well as the people, like this boy, living in conditions beyond what you and I can even comprehend. This is poverty. I don't know if they let people in there anymore because there's a lot of thieves running around, I guess. Yeah, the doors are closed, Lady of Piety. More dogs. Yeah. At least they're not. These uh, are nice doggy. That's a violent. nice doggy. Hi, That's Kitty. a nice. Hi, Kitty. Hi. Hi. We've got an issue now. They're following us. Hey, I have no food for you. I'm sorry. You can't even look at them. For some, no. This isn't a dream trip. But for me, it always has been to witness the poverty in the world, the real life situations and conditions, the animals like this one with no leg, to see the differences in our society. This is how we become more grateful. When we see the hungry, the poor suffering, we realize how good we have it. A trip like this is not just a journey, a vacation, it's an opportunity to witness the rest of the world and what other people are going through so that you can feel more abundant and also recognize that you can do more to help. Help others and give more, give back. That's what life is really all about. How can we give and serve others in the highest and greatest way?